Well, good morning, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. Hey, I'm sitting out here in my 2020 Toyota Tacoma, and I wanted to try something. You know, I've got a little pet peeve thing with the 360 degree display, and I mentioned this in another video. Let me turn the camera around. You guys can see right here. This is what I'm looking at right now. This is the 360 degree uh, camera display. And my little pet peeve is that the truck that they show here, I mean, if you want to make it as realistic as possible, right? If I was actually standing up above the truck and filming down, my truck isn't white. It should be blue. Voodoo blue, to be specific. So, I had mentioned that, like I said, in, uh, in a previous video, and a subscriber actually sent me some directions that he had found as to how to change that. Now, he wasn't sure that they worked. I'm not sure that it's going to work, but we're going to give it a try. So, I'm going to put you guys up here on the sunroof, and, uh, and then we're going to run through those instructions real quick and see if, indeed, we can change the color of that uh, truck on my display. Okay, you guys can see, let me, uh, I'll put you back on view. You can see the screen right here, we still have the white truck. Now, here are the instructions. So this is what we're going to do and we're going to see if it works. What he had told me here is, start the truck and let the screen fully load to the home screen. Alright, there is the home screen, the truck is already running. Then, locate the headlight switch. Um, which is right over on the stock, uh, over over there. Uh, locate the headlight switch and the audio button, which is here. Uh, on the head unit. You hold the audio button while flipping the headlight stock between auto and on, the middle two options, three times. Then it loads a menu with multiple options, and he believes one is the camera settings where you would go into a menu of the colors. Choose the color you want and hit OK. To get out, just turn the truck off and restart the truck and, and you're all set. Okay, so we're going to give that a try. We're going to hold the audio button and we're going to flip this switch back and forth three times. So wish me luck. Here we go. One, two, three. Ah! check that out. Uh, we do have a service menu now and going back here it says uh, camera settings. We have failure diagnosis, function check settings, service information and product information. I don't know, let's go to function check setting. Alright, camera setting right down here on the bottom. This is cool, I'm encouraged. Let's hit that. Uh, body color setting. This is awesome! Check that out. Can you guys see that? Let me turn the camera a little bit there. So let's hit body color setting. Oh, look at that. White, black, beige, blue, green, red, and gray. This is awesome. Let's go to blue. Ah, oh, there's my blue truck. Check that out. We're going to hit OK. And that's it. We're done. And the rest of this stuff, uh, I'm not sure I want to mess with. Let's see what else we had here. Panel and steering switch, touch switch, microphone check, vehicle signal, uh, HF voice quality setting in camera. And then there's the next page. Where does that go? MEU inspection. Let's just go back. And that's it. We can't do anything else. Now, he had mentioned turning the vehicle off and then back on to get out of this screen. Let's see if that works. Here we go. All right. I've shut the truck off. We're out of the screen. This is too cool, man. Now, let's go ahead and turn it back on. And I hope it's a normal screen. So far, so good. Let's see what happens. You have to wait for this to load, of course. Hit continue. And we're back to the normal screen, but what about the view? Do wait a minute. Okay, we just hit okay. I'm hoping that should be okay. I didn't do anything else. Now let's go ahead and change the view. And look at that. I have my blue truck. That is freaking awesome. Awesome. 
I want to give a shout out here, by the way, out to Fred Lentz. Fred Lentz is a subscriber on the channel, and he's the one that sent me these directions. And I really appreciate that, Fred. That is awesome. Look at that right there. Blue truck. Okay, there you go. I am super excited. You know, sometimes it's just the little things, right? I mean, it's just a picture on a screen. But how cool is that, that you can adjust the color to match your truck? And it even looks voodoo blue. Check that out. The blue that they have on here even looks voodoo blue. That is pretty darn awesome. Um, easy to do. Just be careful. If you're going to try this and you're going to get into those settings, I know all of us are tempted, as am I, to go ahead and see what else I can do. And I probably will do that. But... Uh, be careful. You're in the service settings and you could potentially screw something up. Anyway, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of that. I think it's pretty darn cool. Thanks for watching. And by the way, if you haven't before, check out my other channel. It is Rob Motion. All about my 2020 Jeep Gladiator. Also, don't forget to click that notification bell so that you don't miss any new videos. Thanks for watching. Bye.